<laughs> right, right. Well, and obviously that's why this issue gets incredibly complicated. And you know, it would be really great actually if we had an economist to help us co-teach this class too, because you know, there's a whole other area which is about all the subsidies that exist to the fossil fuel industry, the path dependencies, all the reasons why it's very difficult for new technologies to compete against highly entrenched existing technologies, which as you say, they're, they're already depreciated or they're already subsidized. I mean, I think we talked about this at some point maybe. You know, there are massive, massive subsidies to fossil fuel production in this, in this country. And those don't get talked about, in my opinion, nearly as much. So it is true that solar and wind need to be subsidized now. In many places, they need more than just a couple of cents per kilowatt hour to be economically competitive. But that's partly because they're competing against an industry that ha is highly subsidized and has been highly subsidized for a very long time. So one remedy that you might propose to friends who believe in free market capitalism as an efficient and effective means of delivering goods and services is to suggest that we begin to phase out the subsidies to the fossil fuel industry to create a genuinely level playing field. And that alone, that one single policy act would go a long way towards making all your entrepreneurs more able to compete in the marketplace. <laughs>